and she started wondering why so many doctors out there were advocating for medical procedures to transition children without solid scientific evidence that the procedures came with an overwhelming benefit for their patients. Now, they're always saying that, oh, this is life-affirming care. No, it's actually not. Well, Charlie, your your genitalia does not define your gender, okay? Then why are you messing with them surgically? Dr. Lee believes that contemporary gender medicine is no longer based on reality, and she's right. Now she says it's more about ideology, and the outcomes and long-term side effects of treating gender dysphoria are murky. Until recently, gender dysphoria was rare and occurred mainly in young males. Left untreated, the condition all often resolves itself naturally after puberty. In some cases, children struggling with gender dysphoria turned out to be gay, according to the studies. But did you notice that it clears itself up? It works itself out after puberty. That's why it is so important, so very important for them to administer puberty blockers because they want this to go on.